everybody out there on YouTube. Um, this is going to go on the Hobbies for Veterans. Uh, want to give a quick shout out to one of our subscribers. Um, username's uh, Laren333. Um, he's seen what I'm doing and wanted to get on board and help. He uh, really did something that uh, kind of surprised me. He wasn't real. I uh, wasn't real impressed with my uh, Stanley Allen wrenches and stuff. So he ordered this Dy uh, Traxxas specific dynamite tool set. Um, it's got everything from four millimeter to well, it's got a four. 5, 5.5, 7, and 8 millimeter uh, hex drivers. It's got three Phillips, three standard, and the Allen wrenches are 1.5, 2.0, 2.5, 3.0, 3 3.5, and 4.0. Uh, a 5 millimeter and 8 millimeter combo wrench. And the smoothest acting ratcheting driver handle I've ever seen. Um, this is a dynamite toolkit. You know, it's really cool. I've been using it for... I've, I, I got this in the mail about a week and a half ago, but with things going on, I haven't had a chance to get in here and shoot a video. And, uh, you know, thank you, Learn, for that. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Um, and he sent me this uh, package. Um, so I can build a... Uh, build another car out of it um, it's a uh, it's a Traxxas uh, rustler it appears to be um, looks like uh, just about everything's here except for uh, speed controller and servo uh, but I don't have uh, a rustler body. I have a I have a slash body, stock slash body. So I will probably be doing the same thing with this that I did with my wife's two wheel drive slash, which is actually not a slash. Um, hers is a um, hers is a rustler also. So we converted the rustler to a slash simply by replacing this piece with this piece and the skid plates. I have skid plates in the house. I have everything to build this into a slash. Um, so um, this will become a uh, this will become a slash. So, we'll get that built in uh, in a future video, but just wanted to give a quick uh, quick shout out and thank you. And we're one step closer to getting the uh, HPI trophy truck ready for Hobbies for Veterans. Um, this is another thing that Laren sent. Um, I'll step over here and grab the... Got the HPI. So one of the things it's missing is oh those are tight. I need to get a body hammer. Um, the crystals in this radio uh, for the uh, HPI were mismatched, and I don't have anywhere that I can get crystals for these so he had a matched set of crystals so we'll plug these in and that's cute slipped right off there
So we'll get an ESC that uh, either change a plug on this ESC or get a different ESC in here. And uh, we'll get this thing going. Um, but anyway, you know, just a quick update on this. We're still... I need to pick up some Dean's plugs on Payday, I think. <clears throat> but this truck, all it needs to be ready to go to its new home is... I need to solder some Dean's plugs on it. Mount this switch with some uh, sticky tape. Um, get a battery or two and uh, a compatible charger this thing's not lipo compatible so I just need to get a nickel metal hydride battery for it and a uh, nickel metal charger and it'll be ready to go I've I know a couple of veterans who are are going out with us and having fun driving them and I think it's uh, about their turn to get them so we're uh, we're getting we're getting ready to start putting more cars in uh, more people's hands we got we've got the we've got this car and we've got the rustler that's gonna turn slash I did a trade with traded some car parts for some RC stuff I've got a, a red cat volcano exp pro uh, that's just a slider, no motor, no ESC, uh, no tires and wheels, no body, but it has radio, uh, and servo, receiver, and all that, freaking all of its shocks and everything, it's literally brand new, it came with a bad ESC, he plugged it in, went up in smoke, just said screw Red Cat, and sent it down the road in the first trade he could and I happen to be the lucky one who was able to get that so um we'll uh we'll see what I'm gonna do with that in the future I don't know if I'm gonna call that one uh a uh, giveaway car or not because I like to be able to work on it and stuff and it's I don't know how good of a basher it is I know this thing's more of a old school racer than a basher so I don't know yet what's gonna what's gonna go on with that I know it's gonna go to a veteran but it may go if I can find a veteran who's interested in getting into short course racing or find out if this thing will meet class specs and stuff like that and see if I can set it up with a motor and speed controller that will make it uh, still fit in specs and be uh, be competitive <clears throat> but anyway just want to do a quick video uh, give you guys an update and uh, shout out to Laren 333 thanks for the tools bro they're amazing and uh, you know I'll be posting build videos on uh, the car that you sent and uh, we'll get it in a veteran's hand soon <clears throat> you know uh, it's very much appreciated it's guys like you that really really help make this possible for me um, you guys are great all my subscribers especially you Larry thank you for the for the package and uh, you know you're awesome <laughs> you're all awesome so you know everybody get out there Enjoy the hobby. Have some fun. Hopefully you've got a loved one who can enjoy it with you. You go out there and just have a little bit of fun. We'll be posting a video here about the same time this one comes up of my wife and I just taking out uh, the the uh, TRX-4 and the Viterra. Just goofing around, bashing a little bit. You know, uh, just heard me just playing. Um, you know, it's... a uh, it's nothing it's nothing great you know we weren't crawling or anything just literally goofing so you know uh <laughs> i don't know what you guys will think of it but hopefully you like it um if you like what i'm doing here uh 
give me a like, subscribe to my channel, uh, share the videos with your friends, you know, get out there, enjoy the hobby, have some fun, spend time with family, that's what it's all about, thank you.